I've got the OnePlus 7 Pro here and today I want to show you how to fix the delayed notification issue that many OnePlus 7 and OnePlus 7 Pro and even the 5 Edge variants are experiencing with their device. Now delayed notifications is something that I have noticed with Oxygen OS for the past few years. I'd say probably at least since the OnePlus 5, maybe even dipping back into the OnePlus 3. And naturally, OnePlus wants to restrict these requests for, up for the latest notifications for battery life purposes. So the company has gone into their version of Android, again, which is called Oxygen OS, and they have added even more battery optimization features than Google has added to Android itself. And Android has its own battery optimization features, which, you know, normally if you were experiencing a delayed notification for a particular app, I would tell you to dive into the settings, I would tell you to go into battery, and then we got battery optimization, and then we have all our apps right here. So if we were having de uh, delayed notifications for push bullet, for example, then we just tap on push bullet, tell the, com the smartphone to not optimize the battery for this particular application. And people usually do that quite often for their important and vital applications, such as Gmail when somebody needs to get a notification on an email as soon as possible, it's just better to have those things set to not optimized. Same thing for WhatsApp or Facebook or anything that you need instant notifications for with social, with your social network and your friends and stuff. There are just some reasons where you do not want delayed notifications. However, again, OnePlus has built in multiple battery optimization features into Oxygen OS. I believe there is two more hidden around here somewhere that even if you set all of those to not optimize for a particular application, you will still have delayed notifications from time to time. It's something that has really, really irked me with Oxygen OS. And again, I get why they did it to a certain point, but a lot of people just want an easy way to tell the software on their phone, hey, when a notification comes in, notify me immediately. Other Android devices make this very easy. Again, we just go into battery optimization and we tell something to not be optimized. But for Oxygen OS, for some reason, at least in the past two or three years, has ignored that with other rules and other features they've added into the software. Uh, I work with somebody at XDA who has the OnePlus 7 Pro as well, and he was experiencing delayed notifications on his latest device with the latest software. So the company is still doing this, and... I finally found a fix for it. It's actually was this is actually something that was used quite a lot back in the day, but hasn't been used as Android has evolved to the point where it just wasn't needed. And now we're seeing the use the need for it again. So you're gonna be going into the Play Store and you're gonna be downloading this application called Push Notification Fixer. Now, if you need a direct link for anybody who's watching this on YouTube, just look below the video. I'll have a link to my website in the video description, which will take you directly to this application in the Play Store. So again, this application is made to fix delayed push notifications, and it does it by just sending a packet, sending a heartbeat network packet to the push connection. 
what a lot of people think is either OnePlus has either tweaked this heartbeat network to the point where it is really, really slow, again, to delay those notifications, which in turn increases battery life. Other people think the way OnePlus has built Oxygen OS that they actually let this network time out the packets that they send to see if there's any push notifications. Again, I don't know what the root cause is, um, but I know a way to fix it. So, again, we're just going to download this free application. Once it's downloaded and installed, just go ahead and open it up. And you get to choose if you want to change the mobile heartbeat interval or the Wi-Fi heartbeat interval. For me personally, I am usually always connected to Wi-Fi. You know, even if I'm going from place to place, I'm going from a place with Wi-Fi to another place with Wi-Fi. And there's not very much downtime in between. So for me personally, I just change the Wi-Fi heartbeat interval to one minute. If you want, you can change the mobile as well. I did a little experimenting with these features. Even though the one minute interval option says it's drastic, I didn't notice any impact to my battery life on the OnePlus 6 that I originally tested this with last year. Uh, again, I, show, I talked to somebody who I work with at XDA about this, and they have not seen any negative impact on their battery life either on their OnePlus 7 Pro. Uh, but again, just, just experiment, see which number you want to go with. Five minutes is recommended, but it is completely up to you. If there's no negative impact on your device, then why not have it set higher? You'll get them even faster. But again, completely up to you. Once you set one of these options right here, and even if you just leave it at five minutes after you open it up, just go ahead and tap on that apply settings option and then tap on OK. So there you have it. That is how to fix the delayed notifications on the OnePlus 7 and the OnePlus 7 Pro.